my name is Hugh Riley. I am the Secretary General of the Caribbean Tourism Organization. I am happy to be here in New York for Caribbean Week in New York. Now, Caribbean Week in New York is an exposition of the color and the culture and the history and the excitement and the vacation special offers of the Caribbean. We come to town to try to say to not just New Yorkers but sometimes to visitors to New York and of course via the electronic media to anyone who has internet access. We try to say the Caribbean is the most exciting vacation destination um, in the world and we happen to be in New York because it is the media capital of the world uh, so we certainly get more attention from the media here than anywhere else but it's also the number one source of visitors uh, to the Caribbean so there's no other city that per capita provides more business to the Caribbean than New York City so it's an important place for us to be for Caribbean Week uh, every year. So what's um, different about Caribbean Week this year? What's a little different this year is the mix. There are some staples of Caribbean Week that we, that we try to maintain. Uh, people always want to know that there is a, a, a very exciting ball. This year it's the, it's the rhythms of the Caribbean ball, uh, which happens uh, on Friday night um, almost at the end of the, of, of the week. It's not the last event of Caribbean Week this year. Uh, people also want to know that there is excellent food. So one way or another we have to have um, food and and music uh, in the mix. This year we've injected some uh, new youth events. We had a student colloquium where seven universities of Caribbean and Caribbean American and American students were vying for very valuable prizes and they presented their views, their visions on sustainability in the Caribbean and it was incredible. We always like to try and inject the romance of the Caribbean in it also. And we had a wedding, as we usually do. Uh, and so a couple uh, was joined together in holy matrimony uh, during Caribbean Week in New York. So that helps to illustrate the romance of the Caribbean. So there are certain elements that we tend to always have in the mix in Caribbean Week. We will also light up the spire of the Empire State Building. We like to do that. Um, that's become an important component of Caribbean week in New York. So some things have been new and different this year and some things have been um, uh, part of the, uh, I almost said, tradition of Caribbean week in New York. And what are you looking f forward to about Caribbean Tales? One of the things that we really uh, have started to pay a great deal more attention to is the film industry in the Caribbean. There's a great deal of, of potential in that. No one has ever doubted the importance of making sure that the Caribbean got seen or mentioned in films. But to find the right exponents of that genre and to bring them together and to learn from them the value of, 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 of the Caribbean is a really very important part of what we're doing in Caribbean Week. So we've always supported the cultural industries, but film now has become an almost crucial part of the mix. So we're very happy uh, to include Caribbean tales in what we're doing this year in Caribbean Week in New York. Thank you.